guys, it's me, Rusher, and I'm going to be doing an art, a dinosaur artist showcase for me. I'm going to be doing a part two later, but let's get on with this. So what I've what I've drawn here, a great masterpiece of blue running in the night, like from that Jurassic World scene where he was chasing the bus thingy, and we can do the trees and stuff, but but. Uh, but it, it's not the best, but it's still a marvelous sight. Next, we have a dinosaur, uh, a made up dinosaur that I'm gonna um, have a cartoon on my ch like, well, like something like it's gonna be like it's basically just something I made up, and its name is Frackjaw something. And then here's here he is on his, and there's a like he's on a platform. Next we have a rampager. My brother keeps on drawing stuff on here. But well, actually you can take a look at Frack Draw. Like I forgot, like, you know. But like now that the camera's focusing, let's take a look at Rampager. I made him by myself. It's supposed to be a raptor to rampaging against the Okay. So yeah, he's supposed to be rampaging. I got the 2000 Spinal, which is kind of the Jurassic Park 3 Spinal. I don't think it looks that much like it, so I just named it 2000 Spinal. And I made it great. I tried to make it look Jurassic Park 3, but then I don't know. And then I made, like, here's it is. I can make it. No. Here I made a Jurassic Park 3 Velociraptor. My brother keeps on drawing stuff like that. But here it is. You can take a screenshot if you want to. Just admire it. I know. So then I have the Jurassic Park 2 Velociraptor. I don't know why that's there. And it's hiding in the bushes, I guess. Really cool in my opinion. Then I just have a, an, a pen sketch of a Tyrannosaurus Rex scaly there right there it's okay it's falling down that's your top and then I have my own spinal rex hybrid it has an acrocanthosaurus type head there I don't know why just added that in there it is right there in the land admire it Now I have the sick trike from Jurassic Park and the Pure Jurassic Park logo. Way wrong. And I just drew Stickman looking out through the cave and stuff. And there's a trike right there. It's derpy head. Next we have the Walking with Dinosaurs Gurgosaurus. It's the Walking with Dinosaurs movie thing. It's really, 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 really deadly. And it's supposed to be on the lookout for something. Like, I can't load the, like, in, ja in, in Walking with Dinosaurs movie, they were on a cliff or something, and that's what I'm trying to do. Oh, yeah, and I forgot. I was using all these drawings that I showed you so far. So far, not all of them are like that. By using oil pastels. You, I have a packet of them right here. My brother lost a few of them. But it's okay. Here it is. An oil pastels. I got these from India and I had them for like two or three years. They're really good to use with and they really blend in with the with the paper. If you mix them together, they mix really good with the paper. Like you can see here. And then I have the bull tree side from Jurassic Park. Park. Two and you should just do a tornado. And it's right here. It's teeth and everything. Yeah, and it has a really good eye right there. And here's a, just a little sketch of a Brachiosaurus. It's not that great, but I can't just draw the Jurassic Park Brachiosaurus standing up. I really do it, it sucks, I know. But if 
if you like it, then you can take a screenshot and... And here is my mom's favorite one that I drew with my pastel. It's an Indominus Rex head. Right here, my brother just drew that. It's right there. It's with its teeth and everything, and it's got spikes everywhere. Then I drew a Jurassic Park Tyrannosaurus Rex. Well, yeah, you can check a screenshot of this too. And like it has like well, it's supposed to be matched up with the dinosaur. So you get to put it together like this. I'll show you. One second. I'll be back. Like this. As you can see here, it's supposed to match up like that. So they like fight or something. And then next, I have a Dilophosaurus from Jurassic Park. It's only totally Jurassic Park. That I'm, right, that I'm, that I'm showing you right now. I have like a billion of them in there. Like a billion of them in there. Next, I have my own serial killer chaos effect hybrid that I made by myself. I use different I use different colors, and this time I did actually use oil pastels. I actually used these. That's what actually what I used to make different colors and make a really colorful hybrid. Next, I just have a Platosaurus, a Therizinosaurus picture, and this one I didn't use oil pastels. I sketched it out. Another one with the Rethronax or Justies versus a Daily Apple Ceratops. They're really good sketches. And here's an unfinished head of a T-Rex because I just felt like drawing that. It's not finished. Then I have an overcoined Baryonyx on a standing on a rock. Right there. And I did draw these. I drew these with the like, I spent like 10 or 30 minutes trying things. Yeah, here I, have a, here I have an Eo Tyrannus. I just really love trying Tyrannosaurus. Like that. And here, I have a dinosaur facing forward to you with basic shapes. It's an epic. No, actually, soon I'm going to be doing a tutorial on this dinosaur with just basic shapes. You have to do it with basic shapes, and it's really easy for beginners who do not know how to draw a dinosaur yet. And I'm going to help them draw one, like this one. You have to use lots of ovals. <laughs> if you can draw ovals, you can draw this. And here I have an Alloramus head. The head of an Alloramus. Next up, I have a Spinosaurus head right there. Oh, yeah, yeah. And this I actually had the help of drawing of a, of a YouTuber named Beanie Draws. So I'm going to do a shout out to him. See, it says shout outs to Beanie Draws. So he's a really cool draw artist, and I recommend you check him out. He can teach you how to draw really good stuff. Here I've had a blue velociraptor, and I also used Beanie Draws help for this one. I also color it a little bit. Here I have an Indominus Rex head. This one, yes, it also has a help. It's really cool though. I really, really, I'm really, really proud of myself at that. I could. Now I don't know why this is upside down, but I have a Carnotaurus head. And yup, Beanie draws told draw me told told how to draw this one. And the Dilophosaurus head right there. Same. Beanie draws Tommy how to do that. And then Beanie draws Tommy how to do this T Rex, and I added a few like sketches thingies for it to eat. Didn't really work hard on it, but, but the dinosaur looks really good. T Rex. Oh, yeah, and this is like literally my, per my mom's favorite. She literally got crazy about this one. It's the T Rex head that Beanie Draws taught me how to draw. He can teach you how to draw this. I mean, like, that's, that he's that good. 
then ne and then lastly, I have an Allosaurus head. He also taught me how to draw this piece too. So, um, well, th that will be all the drawings I'll be showing you today. I hope you enjoyed this video, and please like and subscribe if you if you like my videos. And I'll see you in the next vid. Oink!